Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So in this video, we are going to talk about a press release which was published on April 14, 2021 where they are saying about Zomedica and uh, why it is a big opportunity. Now this press release is by CNA Finance so if you want you can go and probably check it out. Now what they are saying is uh, these are all basic things that about Zomedica and where it was and uh, right now it is trading at a dollar or below now or they are also talked about their platform diagnostic platform true pharma and why it is went up we know because of a huge retail participation and now the retail participation went down and also what they are talking about uh, is an opportunity which they think that its product and great value proposition uh, is <laughs> headed down and that's why they are thinking about this decline as a great opportunity now as a bottom line what they are saying is they are waiting for the company to give updates on their commercial performance and reason being they are waiting for the company's next press release so and as it has been 29 or 30 days since the company's last press release which means I mean if it is 14th of uh, if this was published on 14th of April then they are talking about 14th or 15th of March so let's see when the next press release will come and what are the things that the market as well as the investor digest out from that but what we can see on the charts may not be the same what we can see on the press release so we will go by the charts and if there is a value that's fine but we need not we need not to purchase at any level for that technicals will help you to find out your good or best support level and that should probably work out for you you know you shouldn't want to take much risk and uh, buying a stock after which it again started falling on the downside so these these kind of things you can avoid with the help of technicals so the levels which you can find as your big support will be in between 0.46 and 0.50 so as you can see currently it is trading at uh, 76 or 75 cents now the big support will only come at or in between 46 cents and 50 cents and don't try to go below 46 cents that's also a big thing to understand here so because if it falls below 46 cents then there is a probability of 27 or 30 cents or even 25 cents so we don't know so that's why 46 in between 46 and 50 cents will be the great support and if it will hold and try to claw back on the upside then it will probably retest its previous high of 2.97 dollar that's what you can see in this particular stock let's see how it moves but wait for the stock to at least settle down at some price and that level will probably be in between 46 and 50 cents on the downside okay so this is the end of the video thanks for watching